All right, so we're making the five different color icings. Yeah. Um, this is my lovely assistant, Miss Vanessa. Watch as she... Wait, Vanessa, we have to put them in five separate bowls. Okay. All right. Okay, you know what? Wait, we need to measure it, though. Let me get my procedure form. My technical procedural form. Okay. Now, now, this may look messy, but in actuality, we measured out... There's a third of a tablespoon in each bowl. A third of a cup in each bowl. Bowl. Oh, the smell. Wait, you need red or not? Like red, red, red. This smells like Play-Doh. I don't think so at all. Well, sort of. And just the blue does, I guess. Good. Start with the fork. And is this good? Oh, excellent. But I see some white that isn't completely mixed. You mean on this? We're thorough here in this household. Alright, so right now, we just finished icing the cookies, and I'd just like to review something. My hypothesis is that the cookies with the pink icing, yes, it's pink, not red. Um, here, I'll show you. That. I think the cookies with that will definitely be eaten or be liked the best. Like, okay, warm colors, you know, in marketing franchises, warm colors are generally paired with food. Take McDonald's, for instance, and the Golden Arches. So yeah, that's my hypothesis, and that's why I think that way. <laughs> Goodbye. Blue, blue, pink, white, green, Pick any cookie. Just one. Any one. These are our first two human subjects, Panayoti and Nico. Um, alright, so Pan, try one of each. The experiment is over. <laughs> Um, I finished my experiment, as you know, and I'm just reviewing my data. My hypothesis was indeed incorrect. I believed that the red, or technically pink, icing would be preferred, but I was wrong. Although it wasn't the least liked, it wasn't the most liked. White, in fact, was the favorite. Strange, isn't it? I wonder why. I really do. Okay, so here's um, an image of my computer screen displaying the data that I collected on my chart. Um, each little figure there represents a test subject and each circle a cookie that the test subject ate. The one first picked is circled in blue and the one last pick no, and the favorite is circled in red. And yes, a cookie can be circled in both blue and red. Now, um, yeah, so it looks here, it, it appears that there was a tie. Both white and blue were, were usually picked first. However, um, there's an obvious pattern of white being the favorite. Um, again, I'm not sure why. What I did observe, though, which could be um, called qualitative data, um, one of my subjects, Mr. Nico Nicopolis, he, he did say to me that he loved the white because it tasted to him like coconut. Um, I don't know. Go figure. But, uh, yeah, so here we have some very interesting results. And I really, I really do wonder why the white was the favorite. I mean, I, I think it was because the kids were talking amongst themselves, like, while they were eating the cookies and saying, oh, white's really good, you know, try white, and then that, like, swayed everybody else's opinions. Okay, well, um, yellow was liked the least. I, I don't know why that is either. Yellow and... 
green it looks like, but, um, uh, okay. Well, we've reviewed our data, and now I guess we'll finish this video.